Okay, I'm going to talk about now about maps. So uh, if you remember uh, in previous versions, uh, what we were able to show in a maps was uh, the uh, coordinates for the TIs, coordinates for the enrollment and coordinates for the events. Okay, but now we are going to, to, we are going to be able to show also uh, attributes and data elements of which value type is coordinate. Okay, so let me show you how it works. So in this case, I'm going to select the malaria case diagnosis treatment and investigation program. And okay, so I'm going to select the map view. And then um, because I have many, many, many TIs here, uh, so I'm going to just use my filter in order to only show the TIs that has been enrolled this month. So in this filter, I have to click on this month. And then it will show you, as you see, I am in Spain now, uh, the all the TIs that has been um, remiss to me my little bit. Okay, so I have these three, these three TIs, and right now they are only showing the, the, uh, the TI coordinates, okay? This is the default behavior as the, the first, the, the first time that you open the map is going to show up only the, the, the coordinates for the TIs. But now you know that you, we have this this uh, we have this button over here. So well, you know that in this button you you you, you can use different map layers. Um, for instance, we have the if we would like to see the relationships uh, of in this case and, and cases. So I can click here, and then it will show the relationships as well. This is not new, but this, I always like to highlight this one because uh, I, I don't know if many people know that now in the in the maps you can show relationship as well. So um, let me then sorry uh, change this to the um, to show the attributes. As, as I said before, uh, if you have in your program, if you have attributes or data elements which value type is a coordinate, then they are going to be show up as a as a map layer. So you can select in this case the GPS attribute, and this is a color just to for you to differentiate in the map. But you are because you can display many things at the same time in the map. So we are using this this label over here to that you can configure as well in the server to show the the the, the color that represents the, the GPS attributes. So I click on apply, and I, I can see that I have two. Okay. Again, these are not the I coordinates, these are attribute coordinates. That can be, for instance, the, the location of the patient or, or well, it can be whatever you want. 